Hi, and welcome back. I'm thinking tonight I'm going to try out my new uh, surface conditioning discs and try my hand at welding the side of the bed, the trim holes. See how that goes. I have never done any welding before, so, you know, bear with me. Anyways, let's get to it. As you can see, my garage still looks somewhat like a wood shop, but this is everything I need to put up is right here. And it shouldn't take me more than a day to do that. And I'll be ready when it's done. And I'll take a picture of it and post it. There's a welder I'll be using. You can see how dusty it is that I have never really used it that much. But I figure with the Bronco I'll be using it a lot. And these are the discs I got. I think I paid 18 bucks for all of them. I don't have too much confidence that they'll last very long, but the last ones I bought from Harbor Freight for, I think it's five for about $6. So they didn't last long at all. So I'm hoping I get my money's worth with these. This is what we'll be trying out uh, tonight. I'm going to go over these holes again with them. Try to get them cleaner so maybe my weld will take and then we'll either file or grind it off because I know it's going to be probably gooped up but anyways I guess I'm going to do that and start the welder up that's a little bit of what's going on outside right now so I tried my hand at trying to catch lightning on camera. Anyways, uh, so I don't got very much time out in the shop tonight. I don't want my kiddos to be afraid. So anyways, we'll get back to sanding and uh, welding and see how far I get on that. Those discs surprised me. It took it away pretty quick and didn't really use very much of the pad. I think it looks pretty nice. Anyways, with these, I'm gonna try to fill that in with weld. And I'm gonna try on this, but I don't know how successful I'll be. Or I don't know if he's successful with these either, but we'll give it a shot. I'm sure that was embarrassing if anybody that can weld just watch me do that but anyways uh that's what they look like probably gonna have to re-weld some of these but some of them don't look too terrible anyways i'm gonna try to grind them down a little bit 
and see what they look like. Didn't go quite as bad as I thought I did. Gonna have to redo this one. Still see a hole. But pretty proud of this one. We got it covered up. This one can just use some more grinding. This one I'm not too sure. Maybe a little bit more grinding and might have to put, plug that one up. And this one just needs some more grinding. But all that done, I don't think it turned out. I got the focus. I don't think it turned out too bad for someone who hadn't done a single weld before. I don't believe I'm going to attempt the bigger ones tonight because it's getting getting late. But uh, yeah, I'm pretty happy. I think some of these, you know, just a thin skim of Bondo or, you know, body filler would 
wouldn't even know that was there, hopefully. Well, I think that's going to do it for me tonight. I'm uh, pretty excited and happy about the welds. Now I'm looking forward to welding more stuff on. So, you can stick around. Maybe, maybe I'll get better. Maybe I won't. Who knows? But, uh, as always, please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll uh, see you. I guess it'll be Monday. Or wait, yeah, Monday. Anyways, good night.